Hi everyone, it's Agnes. And today we have an interview with someone very special. His name is Kimoni and Kimoni is in, where are you? Andre Terrace. Yep, and in what country? Starts with a B. Bermuda. Bermuda. <laughs> and when we were talking the other day, I said to you, when your mum watches YouTube, what's the one thing that you remember? And do you remember what you said to me? Yes. What did you say? I am love. Say it again. I am love. I am love. So what made you say that? Do you think that's an important thing? Yes. Yeah. Why do you think it's important? Do you think some people don't know that? Yeah. And you know what, Kimoni? I think some big people don't know that. Some big, big people, people that are much older than you don't know that. So the fact that you know that, and how old are you? Five and a half. Yeah, the half's important, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. So I want to ask you, because you're five and a half now, when you are thinking about things is there some things that you would like to have yes so what kind of things can you tell us what kind of things you would like to have i would like to have a lightning mcqueen bed yeah and what else Is there some toys or some? And into the Spider Verse toys. Into what toys? Barman into the Spider Verse. Wow, okay. And can you, when you think about that, do you imagine it in your head? Yes. Do you see it with pictures? Yes. So tell me what you see when you think about it. I see Miles Morales versus Kingpin. Oh, and are they fighting? Yes. Ah, and who wins? Kingpin. Ah. So, so you Miles is almost stronger. Ah. And do you like that because it makes you stronger? Yes. <laughs> well, that's good. That's good. And what other things do you think about? Like things that you'd like to have, things that you'd like to do. What are the things you think about? What other things? I would like to do jumping on the, on the trampoline if I had one. If you had one. Okay. Well... The thing is, you understand that if you think about something in your head and you imagine it, then it can come to you. You know, there was a story. I'm going to tell you a little story. There was a boy. He was about your age and he wanted a puppy. And his mom said, no. His dad said, no, you're not having a puppy. And he thought, well, I know that my imagination can create and bring to me what I want. So what he did was he went to sleep every night in his bed and he imagined petting the puppy. He would give him some food. He'd give him some water. And every night he went to bed, he imagined the dog, the little puppy was sleeping next to him and he could feel the dog. He was warm and he had soft fur. And one day, not long after, the boy's grandpa came and he had a puppy for him. So even though his mom said no and his dad said no, 
his grandfather still brought him the puppy. So his imagination, he thought about it every night before he went to bed and then the puppy came. So that is a bit like what you do when you start to think about what you want, isn't it? It's the same. Yes. Yeah. Now, can I ask you when you do, when you see the pictures in your head, do you see it in color or in black and white? Color. You see it all in color. What colors do you see? Blue and red and black and brown and yellow. Nice. And gray. And when you see it, are you in the picture or are you just watching the picture? Oh, you're not sure. Just think for a minute. Am I looking at what's happening or am I doing it? What do you think? I am looking. You're looking. Okay. So like when you're looking at the TV, it's the same. Yes. Wow. Well, that's good. You're already practicing using this imagination. Yeah, your brain and your mind. That's good. Do you like doing it? Is it fun? <laughs> You're not sure. Ah. <laughs> uh, well, is there anything else you want to tell me? Anything special? I'm going to a children's fair at West Pembroke. Lovely. And there's going to be rides and things there? Yes, train rides. Yeah. Fun castle, which, which I want. I want a fun castle. Yeah. And face painted. Oh, beautiful. And when you get your face painted, who do you like to be? Mm. One of the superheroes, maybe? Yes. Which one? Dash. Ah, okay. And what colors does he have? He has red, black, and... Can't remember the other color. That's all right. You still got two. That's good. <laughs> And peach. Oh, and peach. Okay, peach color. Wow. Okay. Well, that's good. Now, do you like surprises? Yes. Okay. Yesterday, I went down the street and I got some things and I put them in a bag and I went to the post office. And I posted it to someone in Bermuda. In Bermuda? Can you guess who it is? Mommy? Nope. Who else do I know in Bermuda? Uh, me. Yeah. So you have got, because you came on to the YouTube, you've got a surprise coming to the post office. And it's got your name on it, not your mama's name. It's got your name. Okay. So to say thank you for coming and talking to me today, you can look at what comes to the door and it will be for you, mail for you. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, darling, thank you for talking to me. I appreciate you coming and saying hello and telling me things. And I will see you again another time. Okay, um, yes. Okay, darling. I give you a big hug and a big kiss from London. Okay. Okay. <laughs>